but right now we're enjoying the lagoon. It's a high tide. People try to coordinate their trip here with the tide. It's very um, quiet in here because there's nobody else here. It's one of the only times I've been in this lagoon. I've been here about 30 times where I uh, have it to myself. Well, one of the things that Riley Bay has become increasingly famous for is this rock climbing. With people from all over the world converging on this spot, it's become a mecca for climbers. And it's expanded to being an international climbing area. It's probably the area that sees more of the world's climbers from all different types of climbing than any area in the world. Mountaineers come here, albinists from Europe come here, ice climbers from Canada come here. At some point, if you're some type of climber, you go rock climbing at Riley Beach. All of these places all around the world that are, that are famous climbing areas, and so many of them these days are being labeled as, this is, this is just like Thailand, it's just like Thailand, or it's as good as Thailand. They're not. This place is as beautiful or more beautiful than anywhere in the world. It's a unique climbing setting, and people always make those comparisons because you're always gonna compare to the best. This is the best place. Well, after a full day of activities, it's time to stop. It. But there's so many more things you can do here. From kayaking out in the Adamant Sea, which is some of the most fantastic water in all of Thailand. You can go out to Noisy Park or Elephant Camp and take your kids for a ride. We'll take care of every single need you need, from your airline tickets to your bus tickets, to anything you can possibly want to do in Rai Lai. Here is the staff at Rai Lai Bay, Bay here has been fantastic. They've done everything I could have asked for and more. These are the people you need to think about here. You have your gardeners here. You have your cooks here, you have the people carrying your bags waiting on you here. These are the people whose jobs depend on the tourism being here. If you have any doubts at all, these people will tell you everything here is same, same, but different. Come back Until next time. When I first came here six weeks ago, I had no idea what really to expect here. I kind of thought that I was going to come here and see damage and destruction all up and down the beaches here in Riley. But as I've shown you, there's nothing wrong here. This place is completely up and running. Even the swimming pool at Riley Boya is almost finished. In places like Phuket, PP, and Kolok, the recovery time there is going to take a while, but eventually even those places will fully recover. The saddest part about Riley is the moment you have to leave. I love this place with my heart and soul. And if you've been here before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And if you've never been here, this is the vacation of a lifetime. You will never regret coming to Rai Lai Bay. It said you must first see the road less traveled before you can open up your eyes to the world. And I hope through this show I've opened up your eyes to this beautiful, magical world that is Rai Lai Bay. With that, I'd like to bid you a farewell. It's Destination Unknown wraps up another episode here in Rai Lai Bay, Thailand. Same, same, but different. And until next time, as always, travel on. ยินเสียงคลื่นกระจกผ่าสายกระซิบไว้แทนคำลำลายกระชิดยามเย็นชวนจะลาพอฟ้ามูโนกาก็พากันบินไปยินเสียงคลื่นกระจกผ่าสาย